and gentlemen. All right, guys, this is my this is it. This is my last boxes. Um, I do have some coming tomorrow, as long as you know UPS shows up. I have more coming tomorrow. This would be a good set to make, um, to be honest with you. You should get an entire set out of one box. You know, like, what, a set and a half almost in one box. So if you do make sets, this would be a pretty nice one to make. Um, very few parallels, too. I mean, you know, comparatively. So you could actually probably do the sky blue set. I mean, it would cost you, but you could make it. Oh, yes, yes. Very, very limited. Very sure. Bobby Witt, first pack. Nice card. Yeah, that's what, uh, you know, people were saying, you know, there's 1,300 of each card. And you're right. That, that's absolutely true. There is. But that's nothing. You know? I don't think people understand how rare 1,300 cards is of each player, you know? Uh, Nick Allen, uh, gold. Did you really get two sets? That's pretty good. That's, yeah, well, that, I mean, three sets would be what you'd probably try for, huh? Bobby Witt. Yeah, you're absolutely right, Mike. I bet they make it. You're absolutely right. Joe Adele. Shortridge, Blake Rutherford. There he is. Dominguez. Nice card. You know, I don't know. That's a good question. Um, generally, you usually take your bigger stars, add up what they sell for, legitimately sell for, and then, you know, your set goes for that. Um, I don't know if that's true about this, but I would probably take Dominguez, Sixto Sanchez. I would take Dominguez, um... Vargas, Bobby Witt, Pawson, Baron. You know, I would add those guys up together. That's what I would sell a set for, you know, generally. I'm not really sure exactly what that would be. Say, say 180 for your Dominguez, you know, and then another 100 for your next three guys. So 280. Like, what, $400? Do you think, guys, 400 And that's just a pure guess. I have no idea what they're doing on eBay. I think you guys are actually talking about it right now. Yeah, 84 Fleer was so awesome. Um, they were $30 on the secondary market day of release. Yeah, I remember. I remember. Um, went to a signing by Dwight Gooden. Um when 84 update released it was the brand new product that day and he was signing for one dollar bryson stott bryson stott uh to 75 um you could get his autograph for one dollar <laughs> and and he would sign like i think three items for a, for that same dollar not it wasn't just you know a dollar an auto you could get like three things signed um and I ended up getting an 8x10 for $1. And then he signed it, you know, for a dollar. Um, but because the set was $30, which was crazy at the time, um, I didn't get one. And man, they just exploded. Grant Levine. Tristan Lutz, Bobby Witt. <laughs> I 
<laughs> yeah, I don't know. He had a big gold tooth. I remember being like uh, really surprised he had this this giant gold tooth. Uh, I was just a kid, you know, at the time, 1984, I was pretty young. Wander Franco, nice card. Wander Franco, sky blue. Volpe. Yeah, that set's just exploded. We used to break that set for like 2000 for a, a nine, you know, uh, every card graded as a nine. And uh, we would we would do the entire set for two grand. Now you can't even you can't even sniff that set for two grand in a nine. Yeah, eighty four is a good set. Um, the Don Mattingly card was just amazing. Alec Thomas. I doubt the national happens, to be honest with you. Cardenas. JJ Bladé, Sky Blue. A yellow foil. I haven't hit a yellow of him. Um, just blues. Nova. Uh, yellow. Just blues. Orange and sky blue. That's all I've hit. And this is the 16th box since I've hit a parallel of Dominguez. Campusano. We've been all around him. Like the guys around him we've hit parallels of. But just not him. Heliot Ramos. Yeah, I go. I go. Uh, tops. I'm doing Tops Chrome Sapphire next. But it'll go really fast, so. No worries. Robert. Sixto Sanchez. Pawson, Logan Davidson, Robert, Sky Blue, Christian Pache. Brady McConnell, Jason Dominguez. Tyler Freeman. Yeah, I mean, I've seen him a couple times. But, I mean, we don't like hang out in the same circles or anything. Gary Sheffield too. Um, Wade Boggs, seen Wade Boggs a couple times. Um, Hulk Hogan. I saw Hulk Hogan in a video store. <laughs> Varland, sky blue. Not that kind of video store. <laughs> it was, uh, uh, what was the place where you could take the movies and trade them in? Movie Stop. It was Movie Stop. Volpe. Glenn Allen Hill Jr. Uh, no, everything's sold out. No, I think that was probably going rate right back then. 
I mean, even Hall of Famers. You could usually get a Hall of Famers autograph in the early 80s for like five bucks, you know? I mean, like, literally, like, you know, I mean, Mickey Mantle and guys like that still got more money, but you could get Hall of Famers for $5 at a signing in the 80s. Jordan Groshans, Bobby Witt. One dollar wasn't. I mean, it was it was good. It was a good price. I'm sure he got paid more than a dollar, though. I think the, I think probably the shop owner probably you know paid him more, just to get him in the door. You know. He was sitting at a card table, just sitting at a little old card table, right out front of the shop, and then you had to go in the shop to buy. Uh, the sets if you got 84 update but um, the 8 by 10s were sitting on the card table with him so you come up with two dollars and you could buy an 8 by 10 and he would sign it all for two bucks Jared Kellenick it's a nice card Woo! last pack Dominguez <laughs> nice Last pack, Dominguez. All right, so still no Dominguez parallel, but I think we did well. Uh, I think we hit four in this one. So uh, Dominguez, Tyler Freeman, Bryson Stott, Bobby Witt, Jordan Groshans, Ethan Hankins, Varland, Astudio, Dominguez, uh, Robert, Pawson, Nova, J.J. Blade, Cardenas, Wander Franco, um, Will Wilson, Bobby Witt, Rollison, Bryson Stott, Sixto Sanchez, Pawson, Dominguez, nope, just three. Bobby Witt, Nick Allen, and Bobby Witt. So just three, uh, Dominguez. Um, one, two, three, four Bobby Witts, and two Pawsons. But still, that's not bad, you know. Not a bad return, I don't think. Two ninety nine is that for a set? I think that's a good deal. I mean, I think so. 